about y'all, but today I am struggling this morning. Do you hear me? I woke up at five something, got up, edited a video, and uploaded that for y'all. And I don't want to do nothing else. It's gloomy. It's been raining. I've been listening to my motivational stuff. And I just cannot find... I got to get some mojo. I got to go to the gym today. I got to... I got to get a mojo going. I really do. Like, I got to find something very much something to be inspired about and this is why they tell people motivation is not enough to get things done it's not because you're not gonna always be motivated you're not gonna always be motivated and right now i'm having one of those not gonna always be motivated moments because what i really want to do if i can be transparent I want to go in the house, make me about two waffles, make me some sausage, hop back in my bed, and take a nap. And then get up and pray that there's some... What in the fuck? Why do y'all always do this shit right the fuck here? Now, I can't fucking go because you have blocked... I hate when they do this dumb shit. This is like the dumbest fucking shit. This is dumb. It's it's stupid. It is stupid. This is just so fucking stupid. All because you're trying to get in fucking Dunkin' Donuts. I ain't gonna let that just add to my emotions i'm not i could have but y'all see i i, I held it together because i could have just been blowing my horn at her i could have made her reverse her car i could have been cussing and fussing. and i could have been doing all that but i'm not <sighs> what i think i'm about to do is go in the house take a shower Yeah, go in the house, take a shower, and try to regain my energy. When I take a shower, taking a shower is like um, a superpower for me. Like, like, if I was a vampire, the shower would be the blood that I need in order to uh, be strong again. So that's what we're about to go do. We're going to go take a shower and get our mind right. I need to go to the gym. <laughs> I want to just cry about it. But I need to go to the gym. But I need some more gym clothes, like gym pants that are like good and squat proof. Hopefully DDs have some. We'll just have to see. All right, y'all. So I came home. I took a shower. I made me some breakfast. Again, I had me three eggs, uh, a small piece of sausage, and two pieces of bacon. <clears throat> I wanted to do waffles or pancakes first of all we had no pancake meats secondly we had waffles but i was like no because i'm making shrimp alfredo for dinner and i'm like you can eat pasta and you can have garlic bread you don't need that so after i got done with that i started um you know writing my stuff out on my agenda and did my block scheduling and this is why block scheduling is so important because Y'all know I didn't want to do nothing. I was not in the mood to do nothing. I really wanted to take a nap. Da, 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 da. But once I scheduled out everything that needs to get done today, according to this, I won't be done doing any work until 11 o'clock tonight. 
when you do block scheduling, when you write down everything that you have to do and you do block scheduling, it really shows you that you don't have all the extra time that you think you have. <laughs> like, especially when you got shit that you need to do and you about your business and like you really have things to do throughout your day. I mean, if, if you just got a nine to five and then you just, you bring your little lazy ass home and you don't do shit else, that's different. But when you have a day jam packed full of things to do, it's a whole different ball game. It's a whole different ball game. So that's why I love when I block schedule because it, 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 it make you realize, like, you don't got no extra time, extra time to do it. Nothing. And don't get offended when I say you go to work, you work at 9 to 5, and then you bring your lazy ass home and you don't do nothing. Don't get offended because I've been there. I've been that person who worked a 9 to 5 and came home, and I don't want to do nothing but watch the newest episode of whatever my favorite show is at the moment, cook for me and my kids, make sure they got a bath, and then go to bed. And to be quite honest, I don't want to go back to that lifestyle. I realized just how much I was missing out on in terms of building a legacy. I don't, I'm going to be honest with y'all. I was having a conversation with somebody yesterday and I was like, I don't even want a man that does that. I find it so unattractive when like I'm talking to a guy and yeah, he done been at work or whatever like that. And then when I talk to him and I'm like, what you doing? I ain't doing shit. You know, I'm just going to sit on the sofa and watch TV and take me a shot and go to bed. You can do it. I do not like that. I don't I don't like it. I feel like those type of people lack ambition. And I'm sorry if I'm talking to you, sis, you lack ambition. Unless you are in your preferred career. If you just a dead end job and this is what you're doing, I'm sorry to be the one to tell you, you don't have any ambition. You don't have any ambition. I love y'all. Y'all know me. Give it to you straight. So for me to date a man that does not have ambition, miss me with it. I don't want him. I want a man that has ambition, a man that's busy, a man. And when I say busy, I don't mean busy doing nothing. Like you busy doing the things that you need to do in order to build. Um. So I got to get on it. Nice. I still want to lay in that bed, but according to the right here, there's no room. What's going on, y'all? So, I'm currently in the store right now looking at, like, gym clothes. And then I found these right here. Y'all know these are, like, the leggings that, like, everybody be wearing. Actually, people be wearing these, like, out. But, no, I'm going to wear mine to the gym. But I don't know if I want to get them or not. Like, is it really worth it? You know? I don't know. It don't feel much like workout. Like, this is not workout material. So, I'm just going to leave that where it's at. That's what I'm going to do. And now, like, since I'm in here, I remember why I stopped buying stuff from DDs. Or not, like, stuff, but gym stuff. Because every time I would get pants from here, they don't stay up. They're not squat proof. So, oh, and I was, I just left Walmart too. I was in Walmart a second ago and Dollar Tree. And it's the last stop. And I'm behind schedule. So, uh, I'm hot. It's raining outside. I think I want to schedule an appointment to get my hair redone because, mm, y'all see how it's doing these? Because I went to the gym and then I was sweating. But, I don't know. So, I need to schedule, um, okay. how are you? I'm good. I need to schedule an appointment so I can get my hair redone. But yeah, like, it's cracking. And I don't like that, like, but I need it to last. Like, I get my hair done every two weeks. So, I really need this to last for like another week. Maybe if I put some guts to be on me and then Kobe, you gotta be in that thing that bad. You need a bath. Look at your face. What you been into? What's up? Oh, you just want hugs? 
Yeah, he is such a sport, baby. And as soon as I stop paying you, you're going to have an attitude about it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Okay, we got to drive. It's time to go. Oh, well, you know the keys mean it's time to go, so you're going to bag up properly. All right, so it's 2.28. Let's go home, take this stuff out of the car, and then it's gonna be time to come right back out and get the kids because I be headed to the bus stop to get them by 2.45. Yeah, my kids. Birthday lamps. So I had to get some more. But like the last lamps sat on the floor. Like they was like the real tall lamps. I said this time I'm not buying those because they broke them. Even though they lasted, they lasted over a year, I think. I think. I don't remember. But Walmart had these for six dollars. And so that's what they're getting because no. See how y'all do with stuff that has to sit on the dresser instead of... Ashley, I need those feelings. Instead of... Um, instead of ones that stand up on the floor. Thank you. Instead of ones that stand up on the floor because I even took the lamp that was in the living room out of the living room and gave it to the kids and it was broke within a month. So I'm like, no more of those. Let's do these. Let's see how y'all do. Oh, only six dollars. I didn't get a lampshade for them because I was like, I need to see how long they finna last for y'all first. Plus, I personally like I like bright light, so I don't care for lampshades. Like, y'all like bright light or dim light? Bright. What does that mean? Like, you rather have a lampshade over your light bulb or just the light bulb so you can get all the light? can't have both. What? You can't have both? But yeah, let me go plug these up. I got some more towels and rags. I got a new vacuum cleaner. Because y'all see, Ashley broke the vacuum cleaner. And um, they tried to give me a hard time about that vacuum cleaner uh, at Walmart. Because the thing says $69. It rings up for $85. And I was like, no. So the first lady was like, oh, I mean, but that says. And I'm like, no, it says this. And she was like, I mean, well, I mean, you can go to customer service. I shouldn't have to go to customer service. But I went, and when I went to customer service, the lady was like, okay. Black lady. Okay, well, just, just give it to her for $60, $69. The white lady at first, no, it's $89. And then she, let me check. Now, mind you, this is the same vacuum cleaner that I got yesterday. Yesterday, it said the same thing. It rung up for $89 instead of $69. So I told the lady, black lady, told the lady, she was like, yeah, I don't know why it's like that. And she changed it, no problem. This time, I get to the register, it's a white lady. Oh, I don't, I don't know. I don't, no, no, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to, she want to check barcodes. Oh, and, and that's not the same vacuum cleaner because it says this and it says that. So I'm looking at it. And I'm like, no, this is the right vacuum cleaner. It says right here is just a smaller print. Oh, well, let me go to customer service. She go to customer service. Well, they paid somebody. They were taking for a while to, to do it. So I was like, I just go to customer service. Went to customer service. They called the black lady and she was like, da 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 da. I'm like, exactly. Bitch. Fuck. Not to say necessarily race, race had a part to play in it, but it's very ironic how each time I went, if I talk, to, when I talk to the black people, they push it on through, no problem. Becky don't want to do that. Becky, go to hell. What other name? This one. I'm proud of you. <laughs> I came to brag about my baby, period. Student of the month for January. Ashley who? Ashley <laughs> Howard. Facts. <laughs> High five again, y'all. 
Yo. Go put it on the uh, refrigerator. Okay. I'm not looking up the lyrics. Leah, look up the lyrics. Okay. Is go be a rock star. Who? Go be a rock star. No, our money is not even that many words in it. Listen. Go be a rock star. Anybody could have made Go that slide. Little, little, little. No, it's a little. Okay, but I could have made that TikTok and put "Go be a rock star." Go get a. Rock star. No, you saying it Go. wrong. You be wanting to say "Go get a little rock star." Like, well, how do you even go get a little rock star? Like, what is that? <laughs> Hi, go. Come on, go cook up hungry. I mean, <laughs> big facts. I'm hungry. <laughs> and it's chicken alfredo. That's something so easy. All you gotta do is cut up the chicken, boil the noodles, put it in the pot together. Boom, bam. I need help. And put the sauce. You need help finding the lyrics, cause it ain't gold little rock star. It's gold little rock star. It's not gold little rock star. Yes, it is. Anaya, you said you don't even know. So what is it? I agree with a little gold little rock star. It's go be a rock star. Go be a rock star. Who said the rock star was little? They were doing that on TikTok. Go little rock star. Literally, go be a rock star. How do you know? How do you know? Kobe, look, How do you know? Eat my sandwich and I'm going to eat you. You can't eat a dog. Because that's illegal. If y'all find my remote, it's mine. Because I don't know where it went. I had it earlier today. You meant if you find a remote. That's what I said. No, you said if you find my remote, it's mine. It's not. Oh, my God. Bro. I feel rain coming from this. Oh, my. <laughs> No, for real. No, I legit just felt that because yeah, it was one too. on my face. I did too. Something just uh, leaking from y'all roof. That, but, be, that be happening to me too. Like, I be laying down. Nothing is leaking though. If it was leaking, it'll be a, a <laughs> circle like a, um, like a big wet. Uh, uh, you yeah. felt that too, I mean, yeah. Naya, was that you? And then something just happened. That was Naya. That be doing. Because as it soon as she said it, something me. fell right here on my floor, on my eye. That was Naya. No. See? <laughs> yeah, oh. You found what, my remote? No, I felt the water. Oh. Why y'all on my, oh, my, my? Why you not cooking that fucking chicken? I need help. <laughs> With what, Kai? You are making chicken after It's literally one of the easiest things you can ever make. It's tacos. And tacos. I make tacos. And spaghetti. Yep, it's spaghetti. Uh, but I need help. No. <laughs> go be a rock star. Go ahead. I don't know the first thing to do. Cut the chicken up. Clean the chicken and then cut it up. Go be a rock star. Damn, damn. Leah, nobody's gonna help you. Act like you in there cooking baked macaroni and cheese, fried chicken, and all this stuff. That's for real. Anaya, why? Why? When y'all ain't got no deodorant, it's because she over here playing Etch-A-Sketch on the deodorant. No, I, I like it with this. You want me to make you give me a dollar so I can go get another one? I'm broke. I don't care how broke you is. You're going to figure it out. I just got a $10 bill, but you going to get 100 pennies? I don't want 100 damn pennies. Yeah, 100 pennies make a dollar. Wait, dude. Yes. 100 pennies. Why y'all broke? See? Where it go? Why is he? Why are you typing in Pop Smoke? It's not even his song. I'm not. Who's Pop? What are you talking about? So it's Pop is a rock star? No way. Megan, who? No, girl. That's. That was Megan. What? Pop is a 
It is no way it's Pop is a rock star. Because it was supposed to be shrimp, but they literally had no shrimp. Kobe likes Babs. No, he doesn't. He don't like Babs no more? No. He used to love Babs. Together I'm walking. I agree with mommy and Naya. I need help with the chicken. I don't know. Oh my gosh, yeah. we hungry. Oh, hey. Have you seen this? Have you want to come show me? No. Well, she said, yeah, well, I heard that. No, I didn't. She said, she said, you better not call your sister no nigga. No. Have you seen this? No. That movie is bad for her. Oh, this is the what is about it about? Violence. No. Violence. Alright, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog right no. here because I slick had an attitude. Bye. Because, because for one, it's been raining all day. Y'all know my mood just has not been right. Then I go in Walmart. They don't have no buggies. So that gave me an attitude because now you got a million people in Walmart walking around with groceries in their hand. Not to mention a lady had pissed me off earlier about the vacuum cleaner. It's just been a this has been a crazy day. Like sitting here chilling with the kids has been like the best I felt all day because I really just been in a shitty mood. So I will talk to you guys later. What? About the vacuum cleaner. No, I went and the vacuum cleaner was supposed to be sixty nine dollars and it was ringing up eighty nine dollars. Stop tapping on that TV like that. Oh. Gina and Georgia need to come out with a new season. Exactly. Oh, real? They do need to come out with a new season. Me and I was watching that. Oh. But um, thank you guys for watching this video as always. Because you didn't have to click this video. You could click the one before. You could have clicked the one after it. Instead, you decided to come keep them in. It's really, really, greatly appreciated. Um, if you are new here, hit the subscribe button. If you are not new here, hit the thumbs up button and make sure y'all leave a comment throughout the whole course of this video because i love talking to you guys and i will talk to you guys later because i'm just not and i don't want to continue to film a video and i'm not feeling you know what i'm saying like that sucks so talk at you later in the words of my grandma